Thieves! We came here to get away from the fighting. I hear those bandits are back again. Why don't the Templars kill them? You're a pretty brown-haired woman, but I guess you're not the one I'm looking for. Mother says we have to run before the bad men get here. <laughs> Your mother's right. You don't look like the other folk fleeing the south. Were you in the battle? <laughs> what makes you think that? You don't look chastened, so you're not from the wilds. And you're not a farmer. I'd guess you saw some fighting. Yes, I was with the king's army. I thought them that survived already marched north with the Tairn. He must be a survivor, or a deserter. Lucky you, I guess. I have some questions. Can't promise I'm gonna answer them. Were those bandits outside the village? Were? You mean they're gone? Um, yes, I drove them off. Well, goody for you. Now there's no one to drive off the blighted refugees. Sir Brian's will be glad, though. He's been talking about offering a reward for anyone who'd run them out. Okay, what's going on here? What isn't? We got chastened barbarians in every farmholder south of Callanhard running from the Darkspawn. Not that they'll be safe here with the army gone. And who's in charge? You could talk to the Elder, though she's got her hands full getting everyone on their way. For now, most folks go to Sir Bryant. He's head of the Chantry's Templars. You don't have a ruling lord? Oh, I believe they mentioned that he, uh, he went south. And by south I mean north. He's gone to war and taken all his soldiers, leaving us to fend for ourselves. There's not going to be much left when he returns, if he returns. Okay, I should go. Don't let me stop you. I brought my family to Lothring because I thought it would be safe. Mm, you're so wrong. I'd rather not talk about your mother. Well, there's nothing to talk about. And besides, isn't your mother a scary witch who lives in the middle of a forest? Much more interesting. To you, perhaps. You would find the moss growing upon a stone interesting. You know what's more interesting than that? Apostates, mages outside of the tower. That's illegal, you know. You did not read that in a book somewhere, did you? I hope the small letters did not strain you over much. Oh, we could not talk about your mother. That works for me. All right, a Templar. You there. If you're looking for safe shelter, I'll warn you. There's none to be found. Move on if you can. Lothering's lost. I was looking for some news, actually. You might find that, though it's probably just frightened gossip. We've had refugees streaming from the south for the last two days. The Chantry and Tavern are full to bursting. There simply isn't enough food to go around, and we Templars can barely keep order. You'd be better off elsewhere, my friend. Can I ask some questions? I'm just out here to keep an eye out for Darkspawn. Please ask someone in town. No offense. Okay. Um, is anyone in charge here? Well, I already asked that. The ban has marched north with Tern Loghain, so Lothering's on its own. Most folks look to Elder Miriam. Otherwise, you could speak to Sir Bryant in the Chantry, I suppose. It's up to you. A few knights have come through here searching for some holy artifact. None of them stopped to help. That's interesting. Perhaps the ashes of Andraste? Back off. I have the right to charge what I wish. You profit from their misfortune. I should have the Templars give away everything in your carts. You wouldn't dare. Any of you step too close to my goods and I'll... It's so nice to see everyone working together in a crisis. Warms the heart. Oh, you there. You look able. Would you care to make a tiny profit helping a beleaguered businessman? I don't think so. Why would I want to help you? Didn't I mention profit? He is charging outlandish prices for things people desperately need. Their blood is filling his pockets. Tis only survival of the fittest. All of these Cretans would do the same in his shoes, given the chance. I have limited supplies. The people decide what those supplies are worth to them. You bought most of your wares from these very people last week. Now they flee for their lives, and you want to talk business? 
Look, stranger, I have a hundred silvers if you drive this rabble off, starting with that priest. I'm an honest merchant, nothing more. Not really honest. Uh, don't you think you're being unscrupulous? Would it help these folks if they could buy no goods at all? They spend their very last coin because they are desperate. And this man preys upon them as surely as the bandits outside the city. Ah, I'm not arguing anymore. Drive off this woman and get your hundred silvers. Otherwise, I'm taking my wagon and leaving. Well, can't you compromise and still make a profit? Perhaps. If that woman agrees, I'm allowed to charge something. Do what you must. So long as the prices do not beggar the needy. Fine, fine, done. And since you don't look too needy, normal prices for you. So, we have come to solve every squabble in the village personally. Hmm? My, but the Darkspawn will be impressed. Oh, come on. Thank you for your generous assistance. May the Maker watch over your path. Thank you. Achievement unlocked. Persuasive. Can I unlock this? No. All chests are locked in this game. The legions of evil are on your doorstep. They will feast upon our hearts. There is nowhere to run. This evil will cover the world like a plague of locusts. Please, you're scaring the children. Better to slit their throats now than let them suffer at Darkspawn hands. There, one of their minions is already amongst us. This man bears their evil stench. Can you not see the vile blackness that fills him? Uh, why don't you keep your voice down? I watch the Black Horde descend on my people. I will not be silent. Please stop! Somebody shut his mouth! But isn't he right? The ban left us. We're going to die. This minion is but the first of those who will destroy us! Uh, you poor man, what's happened to you? My family, my clan, those creatures butchered them all. Some of us fled here, but we cannot escape the dog spawn! How did you escape? No! I won't listen to the words of a man tainted by Darkspawn! I'm not evil, please. Talk to me. I ran, hearing my wife's screams as they dragged her off. I'm sorry for your loss. Why am I here? I should not have gone! <laughs> he was right, wasn't he? There's no hope for us. Uh, he was just traumatized. There's always hope. You're right. We can't give up. But we can't fight. What are we supposed to do? We can't lie down and die either. We must go north to Denerim. And Eileen spoke unto the masses. My hearth is yours. My bread is yours. My life is yours. For all who walk in the sight of the Maker are one. Um, hello? <laughs> you don't talk much, do you? Let all repeat the chant of light. Only the word dispels the darkness upon us. He can't answer you. He's Chanter Devons. Um, what's a chanter? One of them that can only say the chant of light. His board has letters of good deeds to be doing. My father fixed Widow Allison's roof once, and the charter paid him, he did. A learned child is a blessing upon his parents and onto the Maker. Yeah, so it's like a vow of silence? He can't talk normally? Unless it's the chant of light, no. And so Rajmael in the heathen temple recanted. Speak only the word, sing only the chant. Then the Golden City is thine, spoke Andraste. A chanter says what? What? Oh, you've gotten <laughs> to speak! Ha! <laughs> what hath man's sin wrought? Oh, he cheated. <laughs> um, okay, anything interesting on that board? Blessed are the peacekeepers, champions of the just.
Okay, so there are some side missions here, I guess. Bandits, bandits everywhere. Okay, I should get rid of some bandits apparently. If you seek refuge in the Chantry, there's simply no room left. You're closed? We turn none aside, but we, we simply don't have room for anyone to sleep. Priests are within if you seek to offer devotion to the Maker, however. May he protect us all. Did you know there were bandits on the highway? Were? Did you drive them off? Well, Sir Bryant will appreciate that. I did. Um, who's in charge of this Chantry? Some revered mother, I guess? The revered mother runs the Chantry itself, and Sir Bryant heads the Templars stationed here. Have you heard any news? Not since Terran Loghain passed by with his army. It's a shame about the king. But with the Darkspawn coming, few can think of anything else. Okay, that was all. Make her watch over you.